right now the story for tonight is three top twin wilderness adventures the twins walk with the woolly mammoth gonna be interesting the snow glimp and dazzled and the sun glinted off the ice the three the family have taken the time machine back 20 years to ice age north america the three the family were on the sky and although the sun was shining it was still absolutely freezing I really think you should be wearing your gloves, they said Professor Pablet. I'm like a woolly mammoth. I don't feel the cold, shivered Dad. Who hated wearing his gloves? In fact, his fingers were feeling a little cheery now, so he reluctantly put them on. The Twitter family had been looking for woolly mammoths for three or four days, and they still hadn't found any. But suddenly, Half is king a little in front of the others, spotted a large head of them. Woolly mammoths! shouted Abby, pointing again. The woolly mammoths were standing still in a wide snow plain just below them. The Twitter family skied down and hid behind a large truck so they could observe the creatures without disturbing them. The woolly mammoths were about as big as African elephants, and they were really a very hairy. What are they doing with their thirst? asked Tulip. The mammoths were using their tusks like giant snowplows to shovel away the snow. How fascinating, said. Professor Pablo, they're getting rid of snow so they can reach the grass underneath to eat it. They watch as the one how the creatures delicately twisted up the grass, tear and cover and put it in her mouth. Oh, sorry, I feel so sleepy. Okay, it's time to go to bed. Good night.